Well, we're back in the pottery studio, and, and all the pottery has been fired once. It was a bisque firing, and now we're back in the studio with Joan and Dolores, and Dolores' is bowl. So Joan's going to show her what to do now as far as the glazing project or process. Go ahead. We're about ready to go. We waxed the bottoms, and now she's going to choose her favorite colors. So that's what we're going to do next. Okay. Okay. Would you like blue? Oh, and then I'll show you another blue. There's, there's two other blues. Are you into blue? It's the favorite. And then this is regular royal blue. And then this is uh, floating blue. And it looks like if you put you, you put the regular blue on and then you put this over the top of it and then it looks kind of floating. So what would you like to do? Would you like to have a light blue or a dark blue? Yeah, they combine with, uh, this has got white. You're very smart. <laughs> There's white underneath and then the uh, blue goes over the top and then we've got some purple in there. Yeah, that's the blue. This is the dark blue, yeah, right there. You want to do any white with it first? Just like that, kind of, get that inspiration. Go about halfway in there. Stripes on one side and something else like that. She's good. Isn't she good? That was good. Yeah. And we're going to leave that dry. Now we'll do the other one. I bet you didn't know that you were going to be famous. Well, it would be nice to be famous for something. For something, though. All right. Now we're going to go over to the dark blue. Now what we're going to do is we're going to put this in and try to get up to the white and maybe a little bit beyond it. Yeah. It kind of takes some imagination, doesn't it, to see what colors they are when you're actually yes, using well, the glazes. This is brown. Yeah. This has got cobalt in it. It's a pinkish brown, but it really has cobalt in it, and the cobalt will turn blue in the firing. So you really don't know. We have a green down here that's gray, but when it's in the kiln, it will turn green. So it does. It is quite deceiving sometimes. And we have to, yeah, and so we'll just kind of go like that and just touch that up a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Cool, huh? Now we know what to do. Okay. Do, would you like a little bit of white over the top part of this? Yeah, and then that'll lighten that up and it'll be kind of like this. This will be dark like that. I think it'll look gorgeous. Okay. Let's go back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you want to be more liberal in your dip, you can, or else just, you know, it's you. Ooh, it's you, yeah. Cool. Isn't that neat? Very nice. All right. So, any other colors? Purple or anything else? You think that's good? Is that enough? it? <laughs> Aren't we smart and <laughs> famous at the same time? <laughs> you bet you guys are. Thanks yes. a lot. Creative.